I'm Ty Quinones right now on your 13 Action News update. Suspect number two in the death of a doctor was ordered to stay in jail for now. Diana Pena is charged along with former Playboy model Kelsey Turner in the murder of psychiatrist Thomas Bouchard. Detectives say the two women were roommates. Last month, Dr. Bouchard was found dead in the trunk of a car outside Las Vegas. A third suspect right now tonight still is on the loose. And looking ahead to tomorrow, former Starbucks CEO Howard Schultz will be in Las Vegas as he considers an independent bid for president. Well, Schultz will be speaking at a software company's conference at the Mandalay Bay. He was planning a town hall event in Summerlin, but that has since been postponed. All right, well, rain now done with in the city. We're going to be drying out through the overnight hours, but rainfall total is not too bad. Mount Charles said two tenths of an inch. Nellis Air Force Base, 1900s at the airport itself. That's McCarran, a tenth of an inch. So we're going to add a tenth of an inch to the yearly rainfall. We're sitting pretty much well above average, pretty close to the average year, uh, yearly rain already. We're going to be much drier over the next couple of days and temperatures much warmer. We're talking near 90, if not at 90, later on this week. Todd. Dan, thank you. Well, tonight on 13 Action News, live at 11, trash troubles have a Valley Pastors patients running thin. He got a surprise bill for almost $3,000, and now the trash company is taking drastic measures to get their money. Remember, you can always get the very latest news at KTNV.com, our mobile app, Roku channel, and the latest version of Apple TV. Thank you for making 13 Action News part of your day.